just imagining how it must have felt or felt, should I say, to be taken and away from your home by very strange looking people or by very strange people, to be torn apart from your family and then to be shackled and to be forced into a journey walking towards the coastline where you didn't know what was gonna be your fate there. In about in 1859, some rich people, plantation owners and, and, and land owners and, and builders and businessmen were at the riverboat gambling, having a good time on Saturday like they always do, like they do now. People go down to the casino. Back then it was the riverboat. And and the richest plantation owner and land owner in Mobile County, his name was Timothy Mayer. And he made a bet. He said, look here, I bet you I can bring slaves into this country right under the government's nose, and they'll never catch me. The other guy said, no, you can't. He said, yes, I can. To have to decide between life or death because every single behavior that you would have could make it that you would either be on in the sea or on that boat so between two evil you have to choose the one that will basically carry on life and many did many made it the story of Africa town is a very important story. And you're gonna be a slave to yourself. And that's the worst kind of slavery to do when you have self-induced slavery. <laughs> 